Have you ever wondered why some technologies completely reshape society, while others barely make a ripple? Today, we're diving into the most revolutionary technologies that are already changing our world in ways most people haven't even noticed. Imagine waking up tomorrow to discover that every password you've ever created is suddenly worthless, or that a new cancer drug has been developed in just 48 hours instead of 15 years. This isn't science fiction. It's happening right now. In the next 20 minutes, I'll reveal how quantum computing will render current encryption methods completely obsolete, potentially exposing every digital secret overnight. From autonomous vehicles that could eliminate traffic deaths to blockchain systems that make corruption nearly impossible, these technologies aren't just improving our world, they're completely reinventing it. By the end of this video, you'll understand not just how these technologies work, but how they'll reshape society in ways that will leave you stunned. Imagine trying to simulate every possible drug interaction using your smartphone calculator. That's essentially what researchers face with today's computers. Classical computers are like solving a maze by checking one path at a time. This works fine for everyday tasks like streaming Netflix or creating spreadsheets, but hits a wall when tackling truly complex problems. Take drug discovery. Pharmaceutical companies currently spend 10 to 15 years and billions of dollars bringing a single medication to market because they must test thousands of molecular combinations one after another. The protein folding problem perfectly illustrates this limitation. Scientists spent 50 years trying to predict how proteins fold, a critical process for understanding diseases like Alzheimer's, before AI systems like AlphaFold made breakthroughs. Even then, these solutions are workarounds rather than true simulations of molecular behavior. Modern encryption faces similar constraints. Your banking information is protected by mathematical problems that would take classical computers 300 trillion years to solve through brute force. This security works perfectly, but only if no faster computing method exists. The fundamental issue isn't processing speed, it's how classical computers handle information. For certain problems, adding more processors helps somewhat, but can't overcome the exponential growth in complexity. Weather forecasting, financial modeling, and drug discovery all hit these computational walls. The U.S. National Institute of Standards and Technology estimates that by 2030, quantum computers could break most existing encryption. Banks, governments, and tech companies are already preparing for this inevitability. What makes quantum computers so revolutionary? While your laptop processes information as bits that can only be zero or one, quantum computers use qubits that can exist as zero, one, or both simultaneously through quantum superposition. This fundamental difference is like having a calculator that can process every possible answer at once, rather than one at a time. When qubits become entangled, they create computational power that grows exponentially with each additional qubit. A 300 qubit system could theoretically represent more states than there are atoms in the observable universe. Google's 53 qubit Sycamore processor demonstrated this power by completing a calculation in 200 seconds that would take our best supercomputers approximately 10,000 years. While this doesn't mean quantum computers outperform classical systems on all tasks, it shows their extraordinary potential for specific types of calculations. Building these systems presents extreme engineering challenges. Quantum processors require temperatures near absolute zero, colder than deep space, to maintain their fragile quantum states. Even then, qubits typically remain stable for only microseconds before environmental interference disrupts them. The control systems for quantum computers are as complex as the processors themselves, using precisely timed microwave pulses to manipulate qubits with nanosecond accuracy. Different approaches to building qubits exist, each with trade-offs. IBM and Google use superconducting circuits, while companies like IonQ trap individual atoms. Photonic quantum computers encode information in light particles. Each approach faces unique challenges in scaling to useful sizes while maintaining quantum coherence. The fragility of qubits presents both the greatest challenge and the source of quantum computing's potential. While maintaining quantum states requires extreme conditions, successful control enables calculations that would be impossible classically. Every encrypted message you've ever sent could eventually become readable. Current encryption methods rely on mathematical problems that are easy to create, but nearly impossible to solve with classical computers. RSA encryption, 
which protects your online banking and secure communications, depends on factoring large numbers into primes, a task that would take thousands of years with today's technology. Quantum computers change this equation dramatically. Shor's algorithm, developed in 1994, demonstrates how quantum computing could break current encryption exponentially faster than classical methods, where a supercomputer would need trillions of years to crack a 2048-bit RSA key. A sufficiently powerful quantum computer might do it in hours. The implications extend beyond theoretical concerns. Intelligence agencies are already practicing harvest now, decrypt later strategies, collecting encrypted data today, anticipating future quantum decryption capabilities. Financial records, medical data, and state secrets transmitted today could become vulnerable when quantum computers reach sufficient scale. Current quantum computers aren't yet capable of breaking encryption. IBM's 433-qubit Osprey processor and Google's 72-qubit Bristlecone represent state-of-the-art, but millions of physical qubits would be needed for practical cryptanalysis. However, progress is accelerating faster than many anticipated. The cryptographic community recognizes this threat. The National Institute of Standards and Technology, or NIST, has selected new quantum-resistant algorithms designed to withstand both classical and quantum attacks. However, transitioning global infrastructure to these new standards presents enormous challenges. Some industries are moving faster than others. Financial institutions handling long-term sensitive data are early adopters, while many organizations still treat quantum security as a distant concern rather than an immediate priority. The next generation of medical breakthroughs may emerge from quantum computers, simulating millions of molecular interactions simultaneously. Current drug discovery methods rely on testing compounds one at a time in a slow, expensive process with high failure rates. Pharmaceutical companies currently spend 10 to 15 years and billions of dollars bringing a single drug to market, with about 90% failing during clinical trials. This inefficiency stems from the limitations of classical computers in simulating molecular interactions. They approximate quantum level processes rather than modeling them directly. Quantum computers handle these simulations differently by representing electrons and their interactions more accurately. This capability could allow researchers to screen millions of potential drug candidates virtually before synthesizing a single molecule in the lab, dramatically reducing reliance on trial and error methods. Researchers have already demonstrated quantum computing's potential in studying protein folding, a critical process in many diseases. Misfolded proteins contribute to conditions like Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, and cystic fibrosis. Quantum simulations could model how potential drugs interact with these proteins at an atomic level, providing insights that would take years to obtain through classical methods. Personalized medicine stands to benefit significantly from quantum drug discovery. Current medications follow a one-size-fits-all approach, but quantum simulations could model how drugs interact with an individual's unique biochemistry leading to treatments tailored to a patient's specific genetic makeup. The financial implications are substantial. Reducing drug development timelines from years to months could save billions in research costs while getting life-saving treatments to patients faster. Diseases that currently have no effective treatments might become addressable through quantum accelerated discovery. Material science stands on the brink of transformation through quantum computing. The discovery of new materials currently relies on modeling electron behavior with precision that classical computers struggle to achieve. Quantum computers operate differently by modeling these quantum scale interactions natively, potentially unlocking discoveries that have eluded scientists for decades. Researchers are applying quantum systems to study high temperature superconductivity, one of materials science's most challenging problems. Current superconductors require extreme cooling to function, limiting their practical applications. Quantum simulations could reveal the mechanisms behind superconductivity at higher temperatures, potentially leading to materials that conduct electricity without resistance at room temperature, a breakthrough that would revolutionize power grids, transportation, and computing. Battery technology represents another area where quantum simulations could drive progress. Quantum computers could model novel electrode materials and electrolytes at the atomic level, potentially leading to batteries with higher capacity, 
faster charging, and reduced fire risk. These improvements would transform electric vehicles, renewable energy storage, and portable electronics. Solar energy conversion could benefit similarly from quantum-designed materials. Photovoltaic cells currently convert only a fraction of sunlight into electricity. Quantum simulations might identify new semiconductor combinations with higher efficiency, making solar power more cost-competitive with fossil fuels. The aerospace and automotive industries could see radical changes from quantum-developed materials. Lightweight alloys with unprecedented strength-to-weight ratios could emerge from quantum simulations, enabling aircraft with better fuel efficiency or electric vehicles with longer range. The global race for quantum supremacy has become a strategic priority for nations worldwide. Governments recognize that achieving scalable quantum computing could shift the balance of power in military, economic, and technological domains. China currently leads in quantum communications technology, having successfully established quantum-secured communications over 1,200 kilometers between ground stations using the Mishis satellite. The Chinese government has invested approximately $10 billion in quantum research through its National Laboratory for Quantum Information Sciences. The United States has taken a different strategic approach through the National Quantum Initiative Act, a $1.2 billion program primarily funding quantum computing research. American companies including IBM, Google, and Microsoft lead in developing quantum processors. The Pentagon has identified quantum computing as critical for national defense, particularly for breaking encryption and running complex battlefield simulations. European nations have collectively committed over 1 billion euros to quantum technology development, supporting research across both computing and communication applications. Military applications drive much of this government investment. Quantum radar systems could potentially detect stealth aircraft by identifying subtle quantum disturbances in reflected photons. Naval researchers are developing quantum sensors capable of detecting submerged submarines through minute changes in gravitational fields. These applications would fundamentally alter modern warfare and intelligence gathering capabilities. The quantum arms race represents more than scientific competition. It's reshaping global power dynamics. As nations pour billions into quantum research, the first to achieve breakthroughs will gain substantial military and economic advantages. Quantum computing is becoming accessible through cloud services before most people realize they're using it. Companies like IBM, Google, and Amazon now offer quantum-as-a-service platforms that let businesses experiment with quantum algorithms without owning the hardware. Volkswagen demonstrated a practical application by using quantum computing to optimize traffic flow in Beijing. The project used a quantum algorithm to calculate the fastest routes for 10,000 taxis during a major public event, considering multiple variables simultaneously, traffic conditions, passenger destinations, and road capacities. Financial institutions are testing quantum algorithms for portfolio optimization and risk analysis. JP Morgan Chase has experimented with quantum machine learning to detect patterns in market data that classical computers might miss. Credit Suisse has explored using quantum computing for Monte Carlo simulations in derivative pricing. Logistics companies see potential in quantum computing for solving complex routing problems. The traveling salesman problem, finding the most efficient route between multiple locations, becomes exponentially harder with each additional stop. Classical computers can only approximate solutions for large-scale versions of this problem, while quantum computers might find optimal solutions. Pharmaceutical companies are leveraging quantum cloud services for molecular modeling in drug discovery. This approach could shorten the time to identify promising drug candidates from years to months, though current limitations mean these applications are still experimental. While quantum computers continue developing, quantum sensing technology is already delivering practical benefits today. These devices exploit quantum superposition and entanglement to achieve measurements beyond what classical physics allows. Quantum gravimeters demonstrate the technology's capabilities by measuring tiny variations in gravitational pull. These devices can detect density changes underground, revealing hidden tunnels or mineral deposits without excavation. Archaeologists use them to map buried structures, 
while oil companies employ them for geological surveys. Medical imaging stands to benefit significantly from quantum sensing technology. New quantum-based MRI techniques could achieve cellular level resolution without harmful radiation. Researchers are developing nitrogen vacancy centers in diamonds that can detect weak magnetic fields from individual molecules, potentially enabling earlier cancer detection by identifying biochemical changes at the cellular level. Navigation systems represent another promising application. Quantum accelerometers and gyroscopes could maintain precise positioning without GPS signals. Submarines could use them for navigation underwater where GPS doesn't penetrate. Quantum sensors also show potential for infrastructure monitoring. They can detect minute strain changes in bridges and buildings, providing early warning of structural issues. Some systems use fiber optic cables with quantum enhanced sensitivity to monitor pipelines for leaks or damage. Consider how the internet revolutionized commerce. Traditional brick and mortar stores faced existential threats, while e-commerce created entirely new business models. Quantum computing could trigger similar disruptions. The internet era created roles like social media manager and data scientist that didn't exist before. Quantum computing will follow this pattern, generating demand for quantum algorithm specialists while reducing need for certain classical computing roles. Healthcare stands to experience some of quantum computing's most dramatic impacts. Quantum simulations could enable truly personalized medicine based on atomic level modeling of individual biochemistry. Drug effectiveness predictions could account for your unique genetic makeup rather than population averages. Cybersecurity presents both risks and opportunities. Current encryption methods protecting your online accounts and financial transactions may become breakable. At the same time, quantum secure communication channels could emerge, offering protection beyond what classical systems provide. The quantum future isn't a distant possibility. It's taking shape in labs and data centers today. Just as few predicted social media's impact in the early internet days, we can't foresee all of quantum computing's consequences. But we know the changes will be profound and widespread. Subscribe for updates on quantum advancements and other emerging technologies shaping our future. Hit the notification bell to ensure you won't miss critical developments in this fast-moving field that will transform our world in ways we're only beginning to understand. In this fast-moving field that will transform our world in ways we're only beginning to understand.